Na mtazamaji huko haya ya kijiri miili ya watoto wanane ilifukuliwa hapo jana jioni kutoka kwenye shamba la Paul McKenzie eneo la Shakahao la Kilifi idadi imesababisha ama idadi hiyo ya vifo ukipanda hadi tisini na nane kufikia Jumatano jioni huko siwasi zaidi ukiwa jaa wenyeji maeneo hayo kufuatia matukio katika shamba la Shakahola Daktari Job Gayo wa usimamizi wa afya kaunti Kilifi amewaarifu na habari kwamba hospitali ya gatuzi dogo la Malindi tayari imepokea hifadhi ya miili tatu kutoka kwa shirika la msalaba mwekundu. Wenyeji wa Malindi wanashinikiza serikali kumpa adhabu kali makenzi kwa kusababisha maafa kupitia imani potovu. I'm glad to announce and to to inform everybody that today we've received uh, a mobile mortuary from Kenya Red Cross. It has a capacity, a capacity of 300 bodies, and this particular facility is going to help us in conserving the bodies which we have received from Shakahola. It, it has been brought here specifically for this particular work, and uh, starting tomorrow we'll start uh, start using it. And uh, it will be here till the day we, we get to account for the last body that will be exhumed. So it's something that could be here for three months, it could be here for up to a year or even more. My name is Pendo. Nyale. I am very happy to have you, Pastor Mackenzie. Because I am very happy to have you. Because I am very happy to have you. Paka mashine zinatoka kutoka Nairobi ameaibisha Kenya yetu. Mackenzie ninamfahamu. Ninamfahamu kwa sababu alikuwa pasta Frunzi na mimi natoka karibu ya hilo eneo. Alikuwa pasta ambaye alikuwa na waumini wengi mwenye anafahamika zaidi. Lakini cha kushangaza ni kwamba tulisikia alikuwa amekataza wanafunzi wasiende shuleni Malindi. Baada ya hiyo kesi hiyo kanisa yake ikafungwa akahamia Shakahola. Sasa mimi kuna siku moja tu nilienda kwake kwa hiyo kanisa na ilikuwa imevuma kabisa wakati huo watu wengi wa Malindi walikuwa wakienda hapo kwake na ilikuwa kikijaa mpaka watu wengine wanakosa viti kwa ukweli huyu jamaa sijui alitokea wapi na tujui kwamba hiyo itikadi kali ilitoka wapi kwa maana amebadilisha roho za watu wengi sana na vile tunavyoona kwamba serikali inachukua jukumu ya kumfunga hata kama afungwe hata kama atafungwa milele Na mtazamaji tukiachana hayo tuangazie taarifa zingine hapa ambapo makumi ya